Azure Gleam. Conspiracy in the Air. Having laid Lenato low, the Kingdom's army proceeds south. Count Roe, who had prior declared fealty to the Empire, surrenders, and Aryan Road falls back into Kingdom hands. With its foothold in the West lost, the Empire amasses troops in the former Arendel territory to the south, prompting the army of Fargus to strike before Adrestia can regain its footing. It's nice Aryan Road fell with little more than a hand wave, but it's hardly comfortable knowing the enemy is still on our doorstep. Comfortable or no, we must take what few chances we do have to rest. Battle will be upon us again before we know it. Not to mention the fortress is still a target. I mean, who wouldn't want their very own impregnable stronghold? Our spies report that the enemy plans to mount such an attack from Arendel land. Arendel, huh? It's been two years since the territory came under the Emperor's control. The wind carries rumors that Edelgard has been keeping Lord Arendel imprisoned in his home since then. If it's true, I'll... I'll... No. Were the enemy to strike, and the fortress city to somehow fall, our path forward in this war would grow exceedingly perilous. The West doesn't face the kind of constant threats we do, so there aren't as many strongholds here as in the North, right? Basically. Though my uncle did say that started to change at least a tiny bit in the past couple of years. In other words, the entire western region of the kingdom is likely to fall into enemy hands if we retreat from Aryan Road now. Indeed. Which is exactly why we must take the offensive and restrain this Imperial Snake before it can sink its fangs into us. Hey, it'll be nice to strike first for once. It feels like we've been on the back foot for a while now. Right you are. And remaining on perpetual defense would only lead to more meaningless, preventable deaths. Offense is the best defense, I always say. We'll crush anyone who has the gall to stand against us. There you go, getting carried away again. Look at them, all stunned into speechlessness. Hmm? Your Majesty, I've bear terrible news. Calm yourself. What is it? The convoy escorting Count Roe to the capital has been attacked by an unknown assailant. They've sustained heavy losses, and it seems Count Roe has gone missing amid the chaos. I see. And these assailants, we know nothing about them? Very little, Your Majesty. The survivors claim to have been attacked by numerous mages. Mages? No. What's wrong? Do you know who it is? You saw the court mage Cornelia during our battle at Ferdia, yes? Well, she disappeared almost immediately after. It's likely she has been burrowed away in Western Fargus ever since. Which leads me to wonder if this attack wasn't her handiwork somehow. It's merely a feeling, though. I'd like to look into it further, if possible. Something tells me the Imperial soldiers won't wait around patiently while we go off hunting for clues. Perhaps you should send a separate unit to investigate, while we attend to the Empire. Yes, that would be prudent for now. We cannot afford to lower our guard for even a moment. The 
this is true. Well, What is it? goes Can I be of service? Reminds me. Hmm. Not so. Very well then. How may I help you?
How can I be of service? I carry a little of everything here. You've got an eye for quality, friend. Hope to see you again soon. Well, well. Hello, come back soon, all right? Good day to you. Indeed. Do you have a minute? Nothing to report. Got it. Supplies are the lifeblood of any army. Everything has its use. Good seeing you. Not good. something is this it is this it is this it is this it Is this it? See you around. Construction comes at a high price.
Don't neglect your daily studies. How's it going? On that note... Things done. Greetings.
Let's give it a go. Have you need of me? I wish to speak with you. By the by. Let's see. Hmm. 